Hello, this is World University and Schools News and Question and Answer on Monday, August 8th, 2022, 10 a.m. Pacific time in the San Francisco Bay Area. Greetings. And as we wait to see if people will join us in this Zoom video conference opportunity for conversation, for question and answer for sharing your ideas about World University and School, uh, I'd like to share some news with you. So World University and School continues to seek uh, matriculating students for Frida's students, uh, ocw.mit.edu, CC4 licensed, uh, centric, degrees, first in English. And in this process, uh, we're seeking a bachelor's degree class uh, beginning newly in January of 2022 and potentially collaborating with the CC4 licensed CS First with Google at World University and School, which is a course learning the scratch programming language on the Google platform. And in this process, uh, the second item I'd like to share with you is World University and School uh, development of our three legal entities with particularly the state of California's Franchise Tax Board is progressing. And we, about a month and a half ago, combined uh, in the creation of a WUAS, my FTB account generation process, combined the WUAS Corporation, a for-profit general stock company in the state of California, uh, with the World University and School 501c3 uh, tax uh, legal entity tax-exempt legal entity in the US federal government. This is momentous news and uh, a huge step uh, since World University and School became a nonprofit in 2010. So World University and School is next seeking to add the third legal entity, a state of California legal entity that's exempt nonprofit World University and School legal entity in the state of California to this uh, My FTB account generation process for WUAS. And this uh, will happen potentially in the next three months when World University and School, school called the exempt number to add this. Uh, World, exempt World University and School legal entity to the My FTB account uh, generation process for WUAS, they said it could possibly take three months. Uh, is the state of California developing their database arrays? Is it addressing um, legal questions with regard to how such two legal entities that World University and School has and other organizations may have um, the WS Corporation General Stock Company in the state of California, for one, and the exempt World University and School legal entity in the state of California would work together and potentially with, in World University and School's case, being a um, nonprofit 501c3 tax exempt charity at the US federal level. So, as World University and School's exempt, California legal entity seeks to um, be added to the WS My FTB account process. There are other considerations or uh, World University and School is wondering whether the state of California is also planning for, um, for example, the uh, build out by the FTB franchise tax board of an approach to 
even the new Silicon Valley long-term stock exchange, um, with, which is uh, a fascinating new development that the Franchise Tax Board would address. And we're, the WS Corporation seeks to list on the franchise, uh, on the Silicon Valley long-term stock exchange. Uh, in addition, is the state of California also developing um, an approach for a new cryptocurrency, such as or other or a whole variety of cryptocurrencies, um, such as Stanford Mind Pi cryptocurrency, uh, which World University and School is also exploring, um, partnering with, collaborating with in the WUAS Corporation, and then listing this uh, WS Corporation on the Silicon Valley Long-Term Stock Exchange. Uh, in uh, all of these developments potentially that are unfolding with the Franchise Tax Board, and as we seek to add our exempt world university and school California legal entity to the WS My FTB account process, uh, World University and School would also be seeking a uh, possibility for uh, all 200 nation states and banks in them, central banks, for example, to get possibly Stanford Mind Pi cryptocurrency uh, through the WS Corporation and to become a main cryptocurrency in their countries. How would that work? with the Franchise Tax Board. If countries were buying um, Stanford Mind Pie through the WS Corporation, uh, which was listed on the Silicon Valley Long-Term Stock Exchange, and what would those mechanisms be, information technology-wise, IT-wise, uh, database-wise, database array-wise? So uh, as World University and School, seeks to complete the WS My FTB account generation process within the next two or three months, uh, I hope, I think. Um, these are the, um, perhaps what World University and School is waiting on since uh, 2010 the, with the WS, uh, with, world, with the exempt World University and School legal entity in California. Uh, which started in 2010, along with the 501c3 World University and School Legal Entity in the federal government. Um, and uh, as an aside, the WS Corporation uh, started a general stock company, uh, started in California in 2017. Um, as we wait for all of this to happen, uh, item number three, uh, World University and School is also seeking to combine the uh, potentially uh, possibility of facilitating a single cryptocurrency or a main cryptocurrency for all 7.9 billion people on the planet, uh, each a Wikidata pin number at you at World University. And it would be through this, these 7.9 billion uh, wiki universitians, people, names, with uh, potentially electronic devices or some sort of uh, alternative if people or kids don't have uh, electronic devices or can't use them or uh, can't read, for example, um, World University and School would seek to facilitate Stanford Mind Pi cryptocurrency in all 200 countries to end poverty via UBI experiments, experiments, universal basic income experiments uh, through uh, you at World University. And with all 7.9 billion people on the planet, 
a Wikidata PIN number. The goal for World University and School would also be to facilitate wiki teaching and learning, uh, free universal education for uh, speakers of all 7,151 known living languages in those 200 countries. And that process of um, building out, facilitating a single cryptocurrency such as Stanford MindPy, and then cultivating and growing and building communities of teachers and learners on the wiki side. I uh, think Wikipedia, I uh, think the thousands of wikis out there where people become teachers, people become uh, uh, creators of potentially knowledge about what the wiki is about. Uh, and at World University and School, anyone could create a new wiki subject page, uh, either academic or creative. Um, check out if there's any cc4ocw.mit.edu courses or cc4.cs first with Google uh, at WUAS courses and add them to this wiki page these wiki pages. So these wiki pages will develop uh, wiki subjects in all uh, 200 countries, uh, main languages. So not in only in English, but um, in all of those languages and potentially if useful, if helpful, in all uh, 7,151 known living languages. People will be able to teach and learn uh, free universal education wise uh, touching base with cc4ocw.mit.edu in courses uh, in seven languages for quality questions too, and grow um, potentially a flourishing community. How to do this is an interesting question. Um, what are flourishing uh, schools, uh, centers of learning, in the world uh, that we could build on and learn from. Um, well, Wikipedia might be one uh, set of uh, approaches to multi-language wiki communities that are knowledge-oriented, the encyclopedia idea. Uh, but Quaker schools might be another example of flourishing communities of uh, learning that uh, are also positive for the students who are involved and create, a, for many, a, a great enjoyment in the learning process, in the being part of a community process, in potentially the sharing idea process, sharing ideas process. Uh, so this is the, question of how world university and school and planning to code for all 7.9 billion people on the planet, each a wiki data pin number uh, in all 7,151 known living languages might create flourishing teaching and learning communities and for open teaching and learning um, where teachers might help create these communities further and reach out to uh, individuals in their regions, in their countries, uh, in their language circles for uh, further developing um, the language community for open teaching and learning, uh, either academically or creatively. There's the great benefit potentially of artificial intelligence and machine learning in facilitating wiki communities uh, by people, uh, but also uh, by um, developments in information technology, which uh, can predict uh, with machine learning from vast amounts of data 
uh, upcoming ways that machines learn that then may anticipate and help humans learn, for example. So these are unfolding um, developments with World University and School. We're very much waiting on um, getting this final piece of the three legal entities together puzzle for adding the exempt World University and School legal entity in California to the WUAS my FTB account generation process such that World University and School since 2010, 12 years ago, uh, would be able to grow our uh, communities of teaching and learning. On the one hand, free degrees uh, that are cc4ocw.mit.edu centric, um, bachelor, PhD, law, medicine, IB high school in all 200 countries in each of their main languages. And on the other hand, wiki schools for open teaching and learning, which are open now, you can teach there. Uh, go to World University and School Subjects page, for example, click edit this page. So that's a little bit of news for today. Uh, World University and School um, is exploring, uh, potentially seeking asylum uh, on the east coast of the country uh, in fairly uh, possibly unsafe San Francisco Bay Area. Uh, but our online presence will continue to grow uh, thanks to also the Wikidata, Wikibase, uh, media wiki migration journey completed. And the process will be um, furthered because we've started, we got the WS Corporation for profit general stock company uh, together with the 501c3 tax exempt charity legal entity at the federal level. Uh, start begun in the WS my FTB account generation process about a month and a half, two months ago. So uh, the next steps that involved paper being sent through the mail, the next steps um, potentially can be done further uh, online with this exempt World University and School State of California legal entity, um, either from the West Coast or the East Coast, or uh, so stay tuned. Um, happy August 1st, 2022. I'm Scott McLeod, and we will likely have another World University and School News and Question and Answer on Monday, August 8th. At 10 a.m. Pacific time, I post these to twitter.com forward slash W O R L D U N I V A N D S C H. And similarly, I post these fairly newly to youtube.com forward slash W O R L D U N I V A N D S C H. Uh, the last uh, weeks, World University and School News and Question and Answer is on the YouTube channel. Uh, check that out. Uh, until next time, uh, I hope you have a good August 2022 and talk to you later. Bye for now.